Please note. These topics are designed to appeal to a wide range of interests and can be adapted to suit different language proficiency levels, providing a comprehensive approach to vocabulary building. Part 1. Wildlife Conservation Efforts – The Crucial Role of Preserving Endangered Species and Habitats in an era where the encroachment of human civilization increasingly infringes upon the natural world, the importance of wildlife conservation efforts cannot be overstated. The conservation of endangered species and their habitats is not just a benevolent endeavor for the sake of biodiversity. It is a critical undertaking essential for maintaining ecological balance, ensuring the survival of our planet's varied life forms, and ultimately, supporting human life itself. Understanding the Crisis The rate at which species are facing extinction in the 21st century is unparalleled in human history. Habitat destruction, climate change, pollution, poaching, and the introduction of invasive species have all contributed to a dramatic decrease in wildlife populations worldwide. The consequences of these losses are profound, not only because of the intrinsic value of each species but also due to their roles within ecosystems. The removal of a single species can trigger a cascade of negative effects across a food web, leading to further loss and degradation of biodiversity. The Importance of Biodiversity Biodiversity, the variety of life on Earth, is more than just an assortment of plants and animals. It is the foundation upon which ecosystems are built. These ecosystems provide critical services that humans rely on, from purifying our air and water to pollinating our crops and stabilizing our climate. The loss of biodiversity threatens these services, posing direct threats to food security, health, and the global economy. In essence, preserving biodiversity is not only about saving animals and plants but also about securing the future of humanity on this planet. Strategies for Conservation Wildlife conservation efforts take many forms, each tailored to address the specific threats that species and ecosystems face. These strategies include Protected areas, establishing national parks, wildlife reserves, and marine protected areas to safeguard habitats from development and exploitation. Legislative action, enacting and enforcing laws that protect endangered species and regulate human activities impacting the environment, such as the Endangered Species Act in the United States and the Convention on International Trade in Endangered Species of Wild Fauna and Flora, sites, internationally. Habitat Restoration Rehabilitating ecosystems that have been damaged or destroyed, allowing species to return and thrive. Captive breeding and reintroduction programs, breeding endangered species in controlled environments and reintroducing them into the wild to bolster population numbers. Community involvement and education, 
engaging local communities and educating the public about the importance of conservation and the steps they can take to help protect wildlife. The Role of Individuals in Conservation While the efforts of governments, NGOs, and conservationists are crucial, Individual actions play a significant role in wildlife conservation. Simple actions like reducing waste, supporting sustainable products, and spreading awareness can have a profound impact. Furthermore, individuals can contribute by supporting conservation organizations through donations or volunteer work advocating for conservation policies, and participating in citizen science projects to aid in research and monitoring efforts. Conclusion The conservation of endangered species and their habitats is an urgent and ongoing challenge. It requires the cooperation and commitment of governments organizations, communities, and individuals worldwide. By understanding the critical role that biodiversity plays in our lives and taking action to protect it, we can help ensure a healthy, resilient, and sustainable planet for future generations. Wildlife conservation is not just about saving other species, it's about saving ourselves. Part 2 The Impact of Social Media on Society A deep dive into its influence on public opinion, behavior, and communication. In the digital age, Social media platforms have transcended their original purpose of connecting people. Today, they wield unprecedented influence over public opinion, individual behavior, and the very fabric of communication. This article explores the multifaceted impact of social media on society using relevant terms to dissect how these platforms have become central to contemporary life. The Amplification of Voices and Ideas Social media has democratized information dissemination, allowing anyone with internet access to share their thoughts, creations, and causes with a global audience. This democratization has led to the amplification of voices and ideas that historically might have remained unheard. Movements like Me Too and Black Lives Matter have shown how social media can elevate social issues, galvanize public support, and prompt action. However, this amplification also extends to misinformation and extremist views, challenging societies to navigate the fine line between free expression and the spread of harmful content. The Echo Chamber Effect An unintended consequence of social media is the creation of echo chambers Environments where a person is only exposed to opinions that mirror their own, reinforcing their beliefs without encountering counterarguments. Algorithmic filtering, which tailors content to individual preferences, exacerbates this effect. While these echo chambers can create a sense of community and belonging, they also polarize societies by diminishing empathy and understanding between differing viewpoints. Social Comparison and Mental Health 
Social media platforms are rife with curated displays of success, beauty, and happiness, leading users to engage in constant social comparison. This comparison can adversely affect mental health, contributing to feelings of inadequacy, anxiety, and depression, especially among adolescents and young adults. The term Instagrammable has even entered the lexicon, reflecting the pressure to present an idealized version of life that often diverges from reality. The Transformation of Communication Social media has revolutionized communication, making it more instantaneous and accessible. Terms like viral, trending, and hashtag reflect how social media shapes the way news and ideas spread. However, this transformation comes with challenges. The brevity and immediacy of social media communication can lead to misunderstandings and the superficial treatment of complex issues. Furthermore, the reliance on digital communication has raised concerns about the erosion of interpersonal skills and deep, meaningful connections. Influencer Culture and Consumer Behavior Influencers, individuals who have amassed large followings on social media, now play a significant role in shaping public opinion and consumer behavior. Through sponsored content and endorsements, influencers can sway their followers' preferences from fashion and beauty products to political opinions. This influence marks a shift in how products and ideas are marketed, moving away from traditional advertising to more personal and relatable recommendations from trusted online personalities. Conclusion the impact of social media on society is profound and multifaceted, affecting everything from how we perceive ourselves and others to the way we receive information and interact. While social media offers unparalleled opportunities for engagement, creativity, and activism, it also presents significant challenges including the spread of misinformation, polarization, and impacts on mental health. Navigating this digital landscape requires critical thinking, media literacy, and a commitment to fostering online environments that encourage constructive dialogue and genuine connection. As social media continues to evolve, so too will its influence on society, prompting ongoing analysis and adaptation to its myriad effects. Part 3 The Science of Happiness Unraveling the Psychological Underpinnings of Well-Being Happiness, a state of well-being and contentment, has been a subject of contemplation and study across centuries, from ancient philosophers to modern psychologists. In recent decades, the science of happiness has emerged as a robust field of research within positive psychology, a branch that focuses on what makes life most worth living. This article delves into the psychological aspects and studies behind what contributes to happiness, integrating key terms and concepts from positive psychology to provide a comprehensive understanding of this sought-after state. Defining Happiness in Psychological Terms 
Happiness in psychological research is often divided into two main components, hedonic well-being, which relates to pleasure or satisfaction, and eudaimonic well-being, which pertains to living in accordance with one's true self and realizing one's potential. These dimensions underscore the complexity of happiness, suggesting it is not merely the presence of positive emotions but also involves a deep sense of meaning and fulfillment. Factors Contributing to Happiness Several key factors have been identified as significant contributors to an individual's happiness. Positive relationships, strong, supportive relationships are consistently linked with higher levels of happiness. The connection, intimacy, and support provided by these relationships fulfill a fundamental human need for social connection. Engagement and flow Engagement in activities that challenge and absorb us, leading to a state known as flow, is associated with greater happiness. In this state, people lose track of time and self-consciousness, immersing themselves completely in the task at hand. Meaning and purpose, having a sense of purpose, or feeling that one's life has meaning beyond oneself, contributes significantly to happiness. This aspect relates closely to eudaimonic well-being. Achievement, goals and accomplishments contribute to a sense of mastery and success, which are important for self-esteem and happiness. Gratitude, the practice of gratitude, acknowledging and appreciating the positive aspects of life, has been shown to increase happiness and life satisfaction. The Role of Genetics and Circumstances Research in positive psychology has also explored the extent to which happiness is determined by genetics and life circumstances. Studies suggest that while a certain portion of our happiness set point is genetically predetermined, a significant portion is influenced by our actions, thoughts, and attitudes, highlighting the potential for individuals to increase their happiness levels through intentional activities and perspective shifts. Positive Psychology Interventions Positive Psychology Interventions, PPIs, are techniques designed to enhance well-being. These can include practices like gratitude journaling, acts of kindness, developing and using personal strengths, and mindfulness meditation. Empirical studies have supported the effectiveness of PPIs in increasing happiness and reducing symptoms of depression. The Hedonic Treadmill an interesting concept in the study of happiness is the hedonic treadmill, which suggests that people tend to return to a baseline level of happiness regardless of positive or negative life events. This adaptation implies that while pursuing goals and achievements is important, Sustainable happiness is more likely achieved through internal changes in attitude and perspective rather than external circumstances alone. The science of happiness offers profound insights into the psychological underpinnings of well-being, emphasizing the multifaceted nature of happiness.
While genetics and life circumstances play roles in determining one's baseline happiness, research in positive psychology highlights the significant impact of individual actions, thoughts, and attitudes. By incorporating practices that foster positive relationships, engagement, meaning, and gratitude, individuals can enhance their well-being and navigate toward a happier life. The pursuit of happiness, as illuminated by psychological research, is not just about increasing pleasure, but about cultivating a deep sense of fulfillment and connection to the broader tapestry of life. Part 4 Cryptocurrencies and the Future of Money Navigating the Digital Currency Revolution In the last decade, the emergence of cryptocurrencies has initiated a profound and potentially irreversible shift in the concept of money and the global financial system. Spearheaded by Bitcoin, the first decentralized digital currency introduced in 2009, the realm of cryptocurrencies has expanded into a diverse ecosystem of digital assets underpinned by blockchain technology. This article explores the innovative world of cryptocurrencies, the foundational role of blockchain, and their collective impact on global finance, while considering the future trajectory of digital currencies. The Advent of Cryptocurrencies Cryptocurrencies are digital or virtual currencies that use cryptography for security, making them nearly impossible to counterfeit. Unlike traditional currencies, they operate on decentralized networks based on blockchain technology, a distributed ledger enforced by a disparate network of computers. This decentralization offers several advantages, including transparency, security, and resistance to censorship and manipulation. Bitcoin, created by an enigmatic figure or group under the pseudonym Satoshi Nakamoto, was not just a new form of money but also a novel financial system outside the control of any government or institution. It paved the way for thousands of other cryptocurrencies, each with unique features, objectives, and technologies. Blockchain, the backbone of cryptocurrencies. At the heart of every cryptocurrency is blockchain technology, a revolutionary concept that has extended its impact beyond digital currencies to various sectors, including healthcare, supply chain management, and voting systems. Blockchain is essentially a chain of blocks where each block contains a number of transactions. Once a block is completed, it is added to the chain in a linear, chronological order, creating a permanent and unalterable record of transactions. This technology ensures transparency, as every participant in the network can view the transactions. It also provides security. Once a transaction is recorded, it cannot be altered without changing every subsequent block, which requires the consensus of the network majority. Impact on Global Finance Cryptocurrencies have challenged traditional financial systems in several ways. 
They offer an alternative to fiat currencies, which are subject to inflation and manipulation by central banks. Digital currencies facilitate faster, cheaper, and borderless transactions, making them particularly appealing for international money transfers. Moreover, cryptocurrencies and blockchain technology introduced the concept of smart contracts, self-executing contracts with the terms of the agreement directly written into code. Smart contracts eliminate the need for intermediaries, reducing costs and increasing efficiency in various financial transactions. Regulatory Challenges and Adoption The rise of cryptocurrencies has not been without challenges. Regulatory scrutiny varies significantly across the globe with some countries embracing digital currencies and others banning or restricting them. The anonymous nature of transactions raises concerns about money laundering and illegal activities, while the volatility of cryptocurrency markets poses risks to investors. Despite these challenges, the adoption of cryptocurrencies continues to grow, with major corporations, financial institutions, and even some governments exploring their use. Cryptocurrencies are increasingly seen as a legitimate investment class, with Bitcoin often referred to as digital gold. The Future of Money as we look to the future, the role of cryptocurrencies in the global financial landscape appears increasingly significant. Innovations such as decentralized finance platforms, which aim to recreate traditional financial services without intermediaries, and central bank digital currencies, which are digital forms of fiat money issued by central banks, are set to further disrupt the financial sector. The world of cryptocurrencies and blockchain technology represents a paradigm shift in the understanding and operation of money. While challenges and uncertainties remain, the potential for these technologies to transform global finance is undeniable. As society continues to grapple with the implications of this digital currency revolution, one thing is clear, the future of money will be markedly different from its past, shaped by the continued evolution and adoption of cryptocurrencies. Part 5. The Renaissance Era. A flourishing of culture, art, and science. The Renaissance, a period of vibrant cultural, artistic, and scientific awakening, spanned roughly from the 14th to the 17th century. Marking a profound shift from the Middle Ages to the modern age, the Renaissance, meaning rebirth in French, was a time of reinvigoration in the interest in the classical learning and values of ancient Greece and Rome. This era, primarily beginning in Italy and spreading across Europe, is celebrated for its groundbreaking advancements in various fields, leading to a lasting impact that shaped the Western world. This article delves into the multifaceted achievements of the Renaissance, providing an introduction to this pivotal period in history. Cultural Revival the Renaissance was characterized by a renewed interest in the humanities, 
which encompassed literature, philosophy, art, music, politics, and science. This cultural revival was partly inspired by the rediscovery of classical texts and the fall of Constantinople in 1453, which led many Greek scholars to flee to Italy, bringing with them significant works of literature and knowledge. Humanism, a dominant intellectual movement of the time, emphasized the potential for individual achievement and the critical study of classical texts. Humanists like Petrarch and Erasmus sought to harmonize the wisdom of the ancients with Christian thought, paving the way for a culture that celebrated human achievements. Artistic Innovation the Renaissance heralded a golden age of art, marked by significant advancements in techniques and a shift in subject matter. Artists sought to achieve a more realistic representation of the human form and the natural world, leading to innovations such as perspective, chiaroscuro, the use of strong contrasts between light and dark, and sfumato, the technique of blending colors in such a subtle manner that there is no perceptible transition. Iconic figures such as Leonardo da Vinci, Michelangelo, Raphael, and Botticelli broke away from the rigid and symbolic style of medieval art, producing works that combined beauty, realism, and emotion in a manner that had never been seen before. Scientific Breakthroughs The Renaissance also witnessed remarkable scientific advancements, as thinkers began to question traditional beliefs and turn to observation and experimentation. This period saw the rise of figures like Galileo Galilei, who challenged the geocentric model of the universe, and Nicholas Copernicus, who proposed a heliocentric model, placing the sun at the center. Moreover, Leonardo da Vinci's detailed studies of the human body in nature demonstrated an unprecedented level of observation and curiosity, laying the groundwork for modern anatomy and engineering. The Printing Revolution The invention of the printing press by Johannes Gutenberg around 1440 was a pivotal technological breakthrough of the Renaissance. By facilitating the mass production of books, the printing press spread knowledge more widely and efficiently than ever before, reducing the cost of books and making them accessible to a larger portion of the population. This democratization of knowledge played a crucial role in the spread of Renaissance ideas and the education of the masses, ultimately fueling further cultural and scientific advancements. The Renaissance was a period of extraordinary creativity and intellectual achievement, marking the transition from the medieval to the modern world. Its cultural, artistic, and scientific advancements not only transformed Europe but also laid the foundational principles that would shape the development of Western civilization. The Renaissance era is a testament to the enduring power of human curiosity and the potential for humanity to reach new heights of achievement when inspired by the rich tapestry of the past. Sustainable Living Practices Embracing a Greener Lifestyle 
In an era marked by environmental challenges, including climate change, deforestation, and biodiversity loss, the shift towards sustainable living practices has become not just commendable but imperative. Sustainable living refers to a lifestyle that seeks to reduce an individual's or society's use of the Earth's natural resources, adopting habits that encourage the conservation of the planet's ecosystems. This article explores practical ways to diminish your carbon footprint through sustainable habits, interspersed with eco-friendly jargon that is becoming increasingly prevalent in discussions about environmental stewardship. Reducing Energy Consumption Energy efficiency is a cornerstone of sustainable living. By opting for energy-efficient appliances, LED lighting, and smart home devices, households can significantly lower their energy use. The principle of conservation, simply using less, also plays a critical role. Simple actions, such as turning off lights when leaving a room, unplugging devices when not in use, and setting thermostats to an eco-friendly setting can cumulatively have a large impact. Embracing Renewable Energy Transitioning to renewable energy sources, such as solar or wind power, helps reduce reliance on fossil fuels, a major contributor to greenhouse gas emissions. Installing solar panels on your home or choosing a green energy provider are ways individuals can support the growth of renewable energy sectors. The concept of carbon offsetting can also complement these efforts, wherein individuals invest in environmental projects to balance out their own carbon footprints. Sustainable Transportation The transportation sector is a significant source of carbon emissions. Adopting sustainable transportation methods, such as cycling, walking, carpooling, or using public transport, can drastically reduce one's environmental impact. For longer distances, consider the environmental benefits of trains over planes. Those who drive can look into hybrid or electric vehicles, EVs, as greener alternatives to traditional gasoline-powered cars. Mindful Consumption Mindful consumption involves making conscious decisions about what products to buy, prioritizing goods that are eco-friendly, ethically produced, and durable. The mantra reduce, reuse, recycle emphasizes the importance of minimizing waste, repurposing items, and ensuring materials such as paper, plastic, and glass are recycled properly. Moreover, embracing a minimalist lifestyle can help individuals focus on what they genuinely need reducing consumption and waste. Sustainable Diet A sustainable diet is characterized by low environmental impact and high nutritional value. Reducing meat and dairy consumption can significantly lower one's carbon footprint, given the high levels of resources required for livestock production. Incorporating more plant-based foods into your diet and supporting local and organic agriculture are steps towards a more sustainable food system. 
Water conservation. Water is a precious resource, yet it is often overused in households. Implementing water saving techniques, such as fixing leaks, using low flow fixtures, and collecting rainwater for gardening, can contribute to water conservation. The practice of xeriscaping or landscaping with drought tolerant plants further reduces water use outdoors. Supporting sustainable practices. Beyond individual actions, supporting businesses and policies that prioritize sustainability can amplify positive environmental impacts. This can include buying from companies with sustainable supply chains, investing in green businesses, or advocating for policies that protect the environment. Sustainable living practices offer a pathway to reducing our environmental footprint and fostering a healthier planet for future generations. By integrating energy conservation, renewable energy, sustainable transportation, mindful consumption, a sustainable diet, and water conservation into our daily lives. We can each contribute to the global effort to mitigate environmental degradation. As we adopt these practices, becoming familiar with eco-friendly jargon enriches our understanding of sustainability and empowers us to be more effective advocates for the planet. The Mysteries of the Deep Sea Unveiling the hidden wonders beneath the ocean surface. The deep sea, Earth's final frontier, remains one of the most unexplored and mysterious realms on our planet. This vast, dark, and cold environment, extending from the edge of the continental shelf at about 200 meters below the ocean surface to the deepest oceanic trenches, is home to an astonishing variety of life. Marine biologists and oceanographers are continually uncovering the secrets of these deep-sea ecosystems, revealing creatures, and phenomena that defy imagination. This article dives into the abyssal depths to explore the unknown creatures and unique ecosystems lying beneath the ocean's surface, employing marine biology terms to navigate the deep. The Abyssal Plains and Trenches the deep sea can be categorized into different zones based on depth, including the bathyal, abyssal, and hadal zones. The abyssal zone and the hadal zone are particularly enigmatic. These regions are characterized by extreme pressure, low temperatures, and a complete absence of sunlight, conditions that have led to the evolution of some of the most peculiar and resilient life forms on Earth. Adaptations to Extreme Conditions Deep-sea organisms exhibit remarkable adaptations that enable them to survive in such harsh conditions. Bioluminescence the ability to produce light through chemical reactions is a common feature among deep-sea species, such as the anglerfish and certain jellyfish. This adaptation serves various purposes, including attracting prey, deterring predators, and facilitating communication and mating. Pressure-resistant enzymes and membrane structures allow these organisms to function despite the immense pressure, 
while slow metabolism rates enable them to survive in environments with scarce food resources. The absence of light has rendered many deep-sea creatures blind, relying instead on other senses like chemoreception, the ability to detect chemical changes in the water, to find food and navigate their surroundings. Bizarre Creatures of the Deep The deep sea is home to an array of bizarre and fascinating creatures. The anglerfish, with its bioluminescent lure, uses light to attract prey in the pitch-black waters. Giant squids, elusive and rarely seen, are known to inhabit these depths, their massive size and tentacles the stuff of maritime legend. Vampire squids, gulper eels, and deep-sea dragonfish are other examples of the extraordinary diversity of life that thrives in complete darkness. Hydrothermal Vents and Cold Seeps Beyond the individual organisms, the deep sea hosts unique ecosystems like hydrothermal vents and cold seeps. Hydrothermal vents, found along mid-ocean ridges, eject superheated, mineral-rich water from beneath the Earth's crust, supporting communities of organisms that rely on chemosynthesis rather than photosynthesis. Bacteria and archaea convert the chemical energy from hydrogen sulfide in vent fluids into organic matter, forming the base of a food web that includes tube worms, clams, and various species of crustaceans and fish. Cold seeps, similar to hydrothermal vents, are areas where methane, hydrogen sulfide, and other hydrocarbon-rich fluids seep out of sediments. These environments also support diverse communities of life, including unique species of tube worms, clams, and microbial mats. Conservation Challenges the deep sea's remoteness and the technical challenges of exploring it have left it relatively untouched by human activity until recent decades. However, emerging threats such as deep sea mining, pollution, and the impacts of climate change, including ocean acidification and deoxygenation, pose significant risks to these fragile ecosystems. The conservation of deep-sea environments is crucial, requiring international cooperation and the implementation of sustainable practices to protect these mysterious realms. The mysteries of the deep sea captivate the imagination, offering a glimpse into an alien world teeming with life that has adapted to extreme conditions. As marine biologists and researchers continue to explore these hidden depths, each discovery sheds light on the resilience of life and the complexity of Earth's ecosystems. The deep sea reminds us of the vast unknown that still exists on our own planet, urging us to protect these dark, cold, and beautiful frontiers for future generations. Artificial Intelligence and Society Navigating the Ethical Terrain and Technological Advancements Artificial intelligence has woven itself into the fabric of daily life, revolutionizing industries, shaping human interactions, and even altering perceptions of reality. 
As AI systems become more sophisticated, capable of tasks ranging from driving cars to diagnosing diseases, they bring with them a host of ethical implications, advancements, and a new lexicon that society must grapple with. This article delves into the intersection of AI and society, exploring the ethical dilemmas, the strides in technology, and the terminology that underpins this rapidly evolving field. The Ethical Implications of AI As AI technology advances, so too does the complexity of its ethical implications. One of the most pressing concerns is privacy. AI's ability to collect, analyze, and store vast amounts of personal data raises significant privacy issues, prompting debates on the balance between technological convenience and individual rights. Another ethical concern is bias. AI systems learn from vast datasets, and if these datasets contain biases, the AI will inherently adopt these prejudices, potentially leading to discriminatory outcomes in areas such as job recruitment, law enforcement, and loan approvals. The concept of autonomy also comes into question with AI's integration into daily life. As machines make more decisions on behalf of humans, there's a risk that individuals will become overly dependent on AI, potentially eroding human decision-making skills and autonomy. Lastly, the impact on employment is a contentious issue, with fears that AI will automate jobs, leading to unemployment and economic disparities. However, others argue that AI will create new job categories, driving economic growth and innovation. Advancements in AI Technology AI technology has made significant strides, fundamentally transforming sectors like healthcare, transportation, and entertainment. In healthcare, AI algorithms now assist in diagnosing conditions more accurately and swiftly than ever before. In transportation, Autonomous vehicles promise to reshape urban mobility, reducing accidents and improving traffic flow. The entertainment industry has seen AI personalized content recommendations at an unprecedented scale, enhancing user experiences. These advancements are made possible through technologies like machine learning, where algorithms improve through experience, and natural language processing, enabling computers to understand and respond to human language. Another significant advancement is neural networks, computer systems modeled on the human brain that can process information in complex ways, leading to breakthroughs in pattern recognition and decision-making. Terminology associated with AI Understanding AI and its societal implications requires familiarity with key terms. Artificial intelligence refers to machines or software that can perform tasks typically requiring human intelligence. Machine learning is a subset of AI where algorithms learn from data without being explicitly programmed. Deep learning, a subset of ML, involves neural networks with many layers, 
enabling the processing of vast amounts of data in sophisticated ways. Ethical AI refers to the development and deployment of AI in ways that are morally sound and socially responsible. Bias in AI refers to systemic and non-systematic errors that result in unfair outcomes, while transparency in AI calls for clear, understandable explanations of how AI systems make decisions. The integration of AI into society brings with it a complex web of ethical dilemmas, technological advancements, and a burgeoning lexicon that defines this new era. As we navigate this landscape, it's crucial to foster an informed dialogue that addresses the ethical implications head-on, encourages responsible innovation, and ensures that AI serves the betterment of humanity. Balancing the benefits of AI with its potential risks will require concerted efforts from policymakers, technologists, and the public to steer AI development in a direction that aligns with societal values and priorities. World Mythologies and Legends A Tapestry of Cultural Heritage the myths, legends, and folklore of the world form a rich tapestry that weaves together the dreams, fears, hopes, and values of humanity across time and space. These stories, passed down through generations, offer a window into the collective psyche of cultures, revealing common themes and unique perspectives on life, nature, and the divine. This exploration into world mythologies and legends not only unearths fascinating tales, but also introduces a variety of mythological vocabulary that enriches our understanding of these narratives. The Essence of Mythology Mythology can be defined as a collection of myths belonging to a particular religious or cultural tradition, serving as a means to explain natural phenomena, human behavior, and the origins of the world. Myths often feature a cast of deities, demigods, and heroes whose adventures underscore themes of morality, love, wrath, and redemption. Mythological Vocabulary To delve into mythologies is to learn a language steeped in symbolism and metaphor. Cosmogony refers to a mythological narrative that explains the origin of the world, while eschatology deals with the end of the world or the ultimate destiny of humanity. Theogony describes the origin and genealogy of the gods. Understanding these terms helps in dissecting the layers of meaning within mythological stories. A Global Mosaic of Myths Across the globe, diverse cultures have developed their own mythologies, each reflecting unique landscapes, societal structures, and existential queries. Greek mythology, rich in drama and tragedy, Greek myths speak of gods and heroes, love and betrayal. The Olympians, Gods residing on Mount Olympus under the rule of Zeus play a central role in human affairs, while tales of heroes like Hercules and Odysseus explore themes of heroism, hubris, and the human condition. Norse mythology, 
From the frosty realms of Scandinavia comes a mythology filled with tales of gods, giants, and the end of the world in Ragnarok. Central to Norse mythology is the Yggdrasil, the world tree, connecting the nine worlds including Asgard, home of the gods, and Midgard, home of humans. Egyptian Mythology Ancient Egyptian myths are deeply intertwined with the Nile and the rhythms of nature. Key deities such as Are, the sun god, and Osiris, the god of the dead, embody aspects of life and the afterlife, reflecting Egyptians' concerns with mortality and immortality. Hindu mythology, a complex tapestry of stories, Hindu mythology encompasses a vast pantheon of gods and goddesses, with Brahma, Vishnu, and Shiva forming the principal trinity overseeing creation, preservation, and destruction. The epic tales of the Mahabharata and Ramayana explore themes of Dharma and Karma. Native American mythology, diverse in their stories, Native American myths often emphasize the interconnectedness of all living things and the importance of living in harmony with nature. Trickster figures like coyote, appear frequently, symbolizing the unpredictability of life and the necessity of wisdom and adaptability. The Unifying Power of Myths Despite their diversity, myths from around the world share common motifs and archetypes, such as the flood myth, found in cultures from Mesopotamia to Mesoamerica, and the hero's journey, a narrative structure that traces a protagonist's adventure, crisis, and transformation. These shared elements suggest a universal human experience, illustrating our innate desire to understand the world and our place within it. Exploring world mythologies and legends is a journey into the heart of human culture and thought. Through the lens of mythological vocabulary, we gain insights into the values, fears, and aspirations that unite and distinguish human societies. These ancient stories, brimming with gods, monsters, and heroes, not only entertain but also offer profound lessons on life, nature, and the cosmos, continuing to resonate with us across centuries. The Physics of Everyday Life Unraveling the Wonders Around Us Physics often perceived as a discipline reserved for scientists and engineers, is in fact deeply intertwined with our everyday experiences. From the rainbow forming in the sky to the smartphone in your pocket, the principles of physics explain the phenomena and technologies that pervade our daily lives. This article embarks on a journey through the physics of everyday life, shedding light on the scientific terminology and concepts that allow us to understand the world around us. The Magic of Light, Optics and Daily Phenomena Optics, the branch of physics concerned with the behavior and properties of light, plays a central role in many familiar phenomena. When sunlight passes through raindrops in the atmosphere, it undergoes refraction and dispersion, splitting into its constituent colors to form a rainbow. 
This optical phenomenon is not only a breathtaking spectacle, but also a demonstration of light's wave nature. Similarly, the mirrors and lenses found in everything from telescopes to eyeglasses manipulate light through reflection and refraction, enabling us to see the universe in greater detail or correct vision impairments. Understanding optics enhances our appreciation for the intricate dance of light that shapes our perception of the world. The Forces That Move Us, Newtonian Mechanics Isaac Newton's laws of motion formed the foundation of classical mechanics, the branch of physics that explains the motion of objects. These principles are observable in countless aspects of daily life. For example, when you push a shopping cart, the cart accelerates in the direction of the force supplied, illustrating Newton's second law of motion. Similarly, the sensation of being pushed back into your seat when a car accelerates is a consequence of Newton's first law, the law of inertia, which states that an object at rest stays at rest and an object in motion stays in motion unless acted upon by an external force. These laws govern everything from the flight of a ball tossed into the air to the orbits of planets around the sun. The power of heat, thermodynamics. Thermodynamics is the branch of physics that deals with heat, work, temperature, and their relation to energy and physical properties of matter. Everyday applications of thermodynamics include refrigerators and air conditioners, which operate on the principles of heat transfer and the laws of thermodynamics to cool their surroundings. The boiling of water for your morning tea is another example, demonstrating the concept of latent heat the energy required to change the state of a substance without changing its temperature. Thermodynamics helps us understand not only these household phenomena, but also critical environmental issues like global warming. The Sounds of Life, Acoustics Acoustics, the science of sound, explains how sound waves travel through various mediums. The echoes you hear in a canyon or a large hall are sound waves bouncing off surfaces and returning to the listener, illustrating the principles of reflection. The pitch of a sound, determined by its frequency, explains why a bird's song is high-pitched while a drumbeat is low. Understanding acoustics enriches our experience of music, speech, and the myriad sounds that fill our environment. The Quantum World, Beyond Classical Physics At the microscopic scale, the classical laws of physics give way to quantum mechanics, a theory that explains the behavior of particles at the atomic and subatomic levels. Quantum mechanics underpins the operation of lasers, semiconductors, and MRI machines, technologies that have transformed communication, medicine, and entertainment. The peculiarities of quantum mechanics, such as entanglement and superposition, challenge our classical intuitions about the world, but offer fascinating insights into the fundamental nature of reality. Physics is not confined to laboratories and textbooks. It permeates every aspect of our daily lives, 
explaining the natural phenomena we observe and enabling the technologies we rely on. By understanding the scientific terminology and principles of physics, we gain a deeper appreciation for the beauty and complexity of the universe. The physics of everyday life reminds us that science is not just an academic pursuit, but a lens through which we can explore and marvel at the world around us. Mindfulness and its Practices Cultivating Presence and Awareness In our fast-paced, digitally driven world, the ancient practice of mindfulness has gained renewed attention as a haven for those seeking solace from the chaos of daily life. Mindfulness, a concept deeply rooted in Buddhist meditation practices, has been embraced by modern psychology and wellness communities for its profound benefits on mental and physical health. This article delves into the essence of mindfulness, exploring its benefits, practices, and the psychological terminology associated with this transformative approach to living. Understanding Mindfulness At its core, Mindfulness is the practice of maintaining a non-judgmental state of complete awareness of one's thoughts, emotions, and experiences in the present moment. It encourages an open-hearted acceptance of what is, fostering a state of peace and equanimity amidst life's inevitable ups and downs. Mindfulness is rooted in sati, a Pali word meaning awareness, attention, and remembering. In the context of mindfulness, it implies remembering to be aware of our present moment-to-moment -moment experience. Psychological Benefits of Mindfulness Research in positive psychology and neuroscience has illuminated the numerous benefits of mindfulness on mental health and well-being. These include Reduced stress Mindfulness practices activate the parasympathetic nervous system, reducing stress and its physiological effects. Enhanced emotional regulation, mindfulness improves the ability to manage and respond to emotional stimuli, reducing instances of reactive behavior. Decreased anxiety and depression, regular mindfulness practice has been shown to decrease symptoms of anxiety and depression by fostering a sense of calm and presence. Improved concentration and cognitive function. By training the mind to focus on the present, mindfulness can enhance cognitive functions, including memory, attention, and processing speed. Mindfulness Practices Mindfulness can be cultivated through various practices, both formal and informal suited to fit into daily life. These include Mindful breathing. This involves paying attention to the breath as it flows in and out, noticing when the mind wanders, and gently bringing attention back to the breath. It's a foundational practice for developing mindfulness. Body Scan Meditation This practice entails mentally scanning the body from head to toe, observing any sensations, tensions, or discomfort without judgment. Mindful Eating 
This involves eating slowly and with full awareness of the flavors, textures, and sensations of the food, as well as acknowledging the processes and people involved in bringing the food to the table. Walking meditation. Practicing mindfulness while walking involves being fully aware of the experience of walking, including the movement of the body and the sensation of your feet touching the ground. Mindful listening. This practice requires giving full, undivided attention to the act of listening, being fully present with the speaker without preparing a response or judgment. Integrating Mindfulness into Daily Life Beyond formal meditation, mindfulness can be integrated into daily activities through mindful awareness. This means bringing a quality of attention and presence to everyday tasks, whether it's brushing your teeth, taking a shower, or commuting to work. The key is to engage fully with the present moment, observing thoughts and sensations without getting caught up in them. Mindfulness offers a path to greater peace, resilience, and well-being, inviting us to slow down and appreciate the richness of the present moment. By practicing mindfulness, we cultivate a deeper connection with ourselves and the world around us, navigating life's challenges with grace and equanimity. Whether through formal meditation or mindful daily activities, the practice of mindfulness is a profound tool for personal transformation, enriching our lives with awareness, compassion, and insight. Great Philosophers and Their Ideologies A Journey Through Time the realm of philosophy has been shaped by the minds of great thinkers, each contributing their unique perspectives on reality, existence, knowledge, values, and reason. This exploration into the ideologies of major philosophers throughout history not only sheds light on the evolution of philosophical thought, but also introduces the reader to critical philosophical terminology. From ancient to contemporary times, the ideas of these philosophers continue to influence various aspects of society, culture, and individual thinking. Socrates, 470-399 BCE, the foundation of Western philosophy. Socrates, the classical Greek philosopher, is best known for his contributions to ethics and epistemology. His method of inquiry, known as the Socratic method or Elenchus, involved asking a series of questions to challenge assumptions and stimulate critical thinking. Socrates famously claimed that he knew nothing except the fact of his ignorance, encapsulated in the phrase, I know that I know nothing. His emphasis on ethical living and constant questioning laid the groundwork for Western philosophical thought. Plato, 428-348 BCE Theory of Forms Plato, a student of Socrates, advanced the concept of the theory of forms or ideas, proposing that the material world is a shadow of a more real and unchanging world of forms. According to Plato, these forms represent the perfect, 
ideal versions of objects and concepts encountered in the physical world. His work in establishing the Academy and his dialogues on various subjects, including his famous work The Republic, have been instrumental in developing philosophy as a discipline. Aristotle, 384 to 322 BCE, Foundations of Logic. Aristotle, a student of Plato, made significant contributions to numerous fields of study, including logic, metaphysics, ethics, and politics. His syllogistic logic, the theory of deduction, became the backbone of Western logical thought. Aristotle's hylomorphism proposed that all things are composed of matter and form, which together explain their nature. His comprehensive system of thought laid the foundations for much of Western philosophy. Immanuel Kant, 1724-1804, Critique of Pure Reason Immanuel Kant revolutionized philosophy with his Critique of Pure Reason, where he explored the limits and capabilities of human knowledge and introduced the concept of transcendental idealism. Kant argued that while we can never know the noumenal world, our knowledge is confined to the phenomenal world, as shaped by our sensory experiences and the categories of understanding. His work on deontological ethics, emphasizing duty and the categorical imperative, has had a profound influence on ethical philosophy. Friedrich Nietzsche, 1844 to 1900, Will to Power Friedrich Nietzsche, known for his critique of traditional moral values and religion, introduced the concept of the Ubermensch and the will to power, an intrinsic drive towards achievement, ambition, and the perpetual overcoming of obstacles. Nietzsche's declaration that God is dead challenged the foundations of Christianity and traditional morality, advocating for a re-evaluation of values in the face of a meaningless universe. Contemporary Voices Philosophy continues to evolve with contemporary philosophers like Judith Butler, known for her work in gender theory and performativity, and Derek Parfit, who explored questions of identity and personal ethics, contributing to the ongoing dialogue on philosophical questions. The exploration of existentialism, phenomenology, postmodernism, and analytic philosophy further demonstrates the diversity of thought in modern philosophical inquiry. The journey through the ideas of great philosophers offers a fascinating glimpse into the minds that have shaped philosophical discourse. Understanding the terminology and concepts introduced by these thinkers is essential for engaging with philosophical texts and debates. As we delve into the ideologies of these philosophers, we are reminded of the enduring power of ideas to challenge, inspire, and transform. Architectural Wonders of the World A Journey Through Iconic Buildings and Structures The world is dotted with architectural wonders that testify to the ingenuity, creativity, and vision of humankind. From ancient monuments that have stood the test of time to modern marvels that push the boundaries of innovation, 
these structures are not just physical spaces but embodiments of cultural, historical, and technological advancements. This article explores some of the most iconic buildings and structures globally, discussing the architectural styles and design principles that make them stand out. The Great Pyramid of Giza, Egypt Dating back to around 2560 BCE, the Great Pyramid of Giza is the oldest of the seven wonders of the ancient world and the only one to remain largely intact. Built as a tomb for the Egyptian pharaoh Khufu, it exemplifies the architectural ingenuity of the ancient Egyptians. The pyramid's construction, involving millions of limestone blocks, remains a subject of study and admiration for its precision and alignment with celestial bodies. The Parthenon, Athens, Greece The Parthenon, constructed in 447-432 BCE, is a testament to the glory of ancient Athens and a symbol of the birthplace of democracy. This temple, dedicated to the goddess Athena, showcases the Doric order of Greek architecture, characterized by simple geometric lines, a sense of proportion, and a focus on symmetry. The Parthenon's enduring beauty lies in its perfect proportions and the subtle complexities of its design, such as the slight curvature of its columns and stylobate, designed to correct optical illusions. The Colosseum, Rome, Italy An iconic symbol of ancient Rome, the Colosseum, built between 70 to 80 CE, is renowned for its architectural complexity and the ingenuity of Roman engineering. This amphitheater could hold up to 80,000 spectators and featured a sophisticated system of vaults and arches, allowing for efficient crowd management and circulation. The Colosseum's design principles have influenced the architecture of modern sports stadiums. Notre Dame de Paris, France A masterpiece of French Gothic architecture, Notre Dame de Paris, commenced in 1163 and largely completed by the 13th century, is celebrated for its revolutionary use of the rib vault and flying buttress. These innovations allowed for higher ceilings, larger windows, and more light than had been possible in earlier churches, embodying the Gothic style's emphasis on bringing heavenly light into sacred spaces. The Taj Mahal Agra, India Built between 1632 and 1653 by the Mughal Emperor Shah Jahan in memory of his wife Mumtaz Mahal, the Taj Mahal is a symbol of love and an architectural marvel of the Mughal era. It combines elements from Islamic, Persian, Ottoman Turkish, and Indian architectural styles, evident in its intricate calligraphy, detailed mosaics, and the symmetrical balance of its structure. The Taj Mahal is renowned for its majestic white marble dome and the delicate artistry of its surface decorations. Falling Water, Pennsylvania, USA Designed by Frank Lloyd Wright in 1935, Falling Water is a quintessential example of organic architecture, 
which seeks to harmonize structures with their natural surroundings. Built over a waterfall, this house exemplifies Wright's philosophy of designing buildings that are in unity with humanity and its environment. Falling Water's cantilevered terraces, integration with the landscape, and use of natural materials have made it an iconic piece of modern architecture. The Burj Khalifa, Dubai, UAE Soaring at 828 meters, the Burj Khalifa, completed in 2010, holds the title of the world's tallest building. Its design is inspired by Islamic architecture and incorporates cutting-edge engineering to withstand the region's high winds and heat. The Y-shaped plan is designed for residential and hotel use, providing stability and maximizing views of the Persian Gulf. The Burj Khalifa represents a milestone in architectural engineering and the ambition of contemporary skyscraper design. Conclusion These architectural wonders, spanning centuries and continents, demonstrate the diversity in evolution of architectural styles and principles. They reflect the cultural values, technological advancements, and artistic visions of their times. Beyond their beauty and grandeur, these iconic buildings and structures continue to inspire architects, artists, and dreamers around the world, reminding us of humanity's relentless pursuit of excellence and innovation in the built environment. The Evolution of Music Genres A Harmonic Journey Through Time The history of music is as vast and varied as the cultures and individuals who have contributed to its evolution. From the classical symphonies that resonate with the grandeur of the past to the electrifying beats of contemporary genres, music has continually transformed, reflecting societal changes, technological advancements, and the endless creativity of artists. This article traces the development of various music genres over the decades, weaving through the tapestry of musical terminology that defines each era's unique sound. The Classical Beginnings The roots of Western music can be traced back to the Classical period, 1750 to 1820, characterized by the harmony, balance, and formality of compositions by luminaries like Mozart, Beethoven, and Haydn. This era's music emphasized melodic expression and symphonic arrangements, setting the foundation for many principles of Western music theory. The classical period gave rise to the sonata form, a structure that became fundamental in musical composition. Jazz, the sound of innovation. Emerging in the late 19th and early 20th centuries, jazz marked a significant departure from classical traditions, introducing improvisation as a key element. Originating from African-American communities in the southern United States, jazz blended elements of blues, ragtime, and European music, characterized by its syncopated rhythms and swing notes. Artists like Louis Armstrong and Duke Ellington pushed the boundaries of jazz, leading to the development of subgenres such as bebop, 
cool jazz, and free jazz. Rock and Roll Revolution The 1950s witnessed the birth of rock and roll, a genre that would become a symbol of youth rebellion and cultural change. Artists like Elvis Presley and Chuck Berry fused rhythm and blues with country music, creating an energetic sound defined by its backbeat and electric guitar riffs. Rock and roll paved the way for the explosion of rock music in the 1960s and 1970s, with bands like the Beatles and the Rolling Stones experimenting with psychedelic rock, folk rock, and hard rock. The Disco Era and the Rise of Electronic Music The 1970s Disco Movement with its four-on-the-floor beats and syncopated bass lines, brought dance music to the forefront of popular culture. Clubs like Studio 54 became the epicenters of a new lifestyle, soundtracked by artists like Donna Summer and the Bee Gees. Disco's emphasis on rhythm and electronic instruments laid the groundwork for the development of electronic dance music, EDM, genres, including house, techno, and trance. Hip-hop, a cultural phenomenon Originating in the Bronx in the late 1970s, Hip-hop emerged as more than just a musical genre. It was a cultural movement encompassing rap music, graffiti art, and breakdancing. Characterized by its rhythmic vocal style, rapping, DJing, turntablism, sampling, and beatboxing, hip-hop gave voice to the experiences and challenges of urban life. Pioneers like Grandmaster Flash, Africa Bombada, and Public Enemy used the genre as a platform for social commentary and change. The Digital Age and the Future of Music The advent of digital technology has transformed the music industry, leading to the emergence of new genres and the democratization of music production and distribution. Genres like dubstep, chill wave, and hyperpop have arisen from the digital realm, characterized by their use of synthesizers, auto-tune, and digital audio workstations, DAWs. The Internet has also enabled global cross-pollination of musical styles, giving rise to hybrid genres such as K-pop, reggaeton, and Afrobeats. Conclusion The evolution of music genres is a reflection of human creativity, culture, and technological progress. Each genre carries with it a lexicon of musical terminology that helps to define its essence and distinguish it from others. As society continues to evolve, so too will music, forever capturing the spirit of the times in melodic and rhythmic forms. The journey of musical evolution is an ongoing symphony each note and chord a testament to the enduring power of sound to express, innovate, and unite. The Symphony of Progress Tracing the Evolution of Music Genres Music, an ever-evolving art form, reflects the cultural, social, and technological changes of its time. From the intricate compositions of the classical era to the digital beats of the 21st century, each genre carries the signature of its period, 
influenced by the changing tastes, innovations, and the global exchange of ideas. This exploration through the evolution of music genres not only highlights the diversity of musical expression, but also introduces the musical terminology that defines each genre's unique sound and rhythm. The Classical Roots The evolution of music genres begins with the classical era, 1750-1820, a period marked by the compositions of Mozart, Beethoven, and Haydn. This era valued harmony, melody, and form, with the symphony, sonata, and concerto as popular forms. The emphasis on structured compositions, orchestral arrangement, and the introduction of the sonata form, a structure of exposition, development, and recapitulation, laid the groundwork for future musical innovation. Jazz, the sound of liberation. Jazz emerged in the early 20th century, a vibrant expression of African American culture. This genre is characterized by its improvisation, syncopation, and swing rhythm. Jazz introduced the concept of solo performances within a group, allowing individual musicians to explore and express themselves freely. With roots in blues and ragtime, jazz evolved into numerous subgenres, including bebop, cool jazz, and modal jazz, each reflecting different approaches to rhythm, melody, and harmony. Rock and Roll, The Beat of Rebellion The 1950s saw the rise of rock and roll, a genre that symbolized youth rebellion and cultural shifts. Artists like Elvis Presley and Chuck Berry blended rhythm and blues with country music, creating an energetic sound driven by electric guitar and a strong backbeat. This era marked the beginning of rock music's influence on society, paving the way for subgenres such as psychedelic rock, hard rock, and punk rock, each fostering an ethos of nonconformity and freedom. Electronic and Disco, Dancing into the Digital Age As technology advanced, so did music. The 1970s and 1980s welcomed the rise of disco and electronic music, genres that embraced synthesizers and drum machines. Disco, with its four-on-the-floor beats, brought people to dance floors with its upbeat, energetic sound. Simultaneously, Electronic music explored new sonic landscapes, leading to the development of house, techno, and ambient music, genres that prioritized electronic effects and synthetic sounds. Hip-hop and rap, voices from the streets. Hip-hop emerged in the late 1970s as a cultural movement encompassing music, dance, and art. Central to hip-hop music is rapping, the rhythmic spoken delivery of rhymes and wordplay. This genre, born from the urban experiences and struggles of African-American communities, is underscored by DJing, sampling, and beatboxing. Hip-hop evolved into a global phenomenon, giving rise to subgenres like gangsta rap, 
trap, and conscious rap, each offering a different perspective on social realities. The Digital Era, A Global Melody the Internet and digital platforms have democratized music production and distribution, leading to the fusion of genres and the birth of new ones. EDM, electronic dance music, K-pop, and reggaeton are examples of 21st century music that blend traditional and digital elements appealing to a global audience. The use of auto-tune, digital audio workstations, DAWs, and social media has transformed how music is created, shared, and experienced. Conclusion The evolution of music genres is a testament to humanity's relentless creativity and adaptability. As we continue to explore new sounds and technologies, the language of music expands, incorporating new terms and concepts. The journey through the history of music genres not only enriches our understanding of cultural and technological progress, but also highlights the universal language of music, a language that transcends boundaries, connecting us across time and space. Unveiling the Future Cutting-Edge Medical Breakthroughs the landscape of medicine and healthcare is undergoing a transformative phase marked by rapid advancements and groundbreaking discoveries. These innovations promise not only to enhance patient care, but also to revolutionize treatment methodologies across the globe. This article delves into some of the most recent advances in medicine, highlighting the medical and technical terminology pivotal to understanding these breakthroughs. Gene Editing, CRISPR-Cas9 One of the most exhilarating developments in modern medicine is the refinement of gene editing technologies most notably CRISPR-Cas9. CRISPR technology allows scientists to edit parts of the genome by removing, adding, or altering sections of the DNA sequence. It's a powerful tool for understanding disease mechanisms and has potential applications in treating a range of genetic disorders including cystic fibrosis, hemophilia, and sickle cell disease. The precision and efficiency of CRISPR-Cas9 herald a new era in genomic medicine, making it a cornerstone of genetic engineering. Immunotherapy, CAR T-cell therapy, Immunotherapy has emerged as a promising avenue in cancer treatment, shifting the paradigm from traditional therapies to those that harness the body's immune system to combat cancer. Among these, CAR T cell therapy stands out. This technique involves modifying a patient's T cells, a type of immune cell, to include a chimeric antigen receptor that targets cancer cells. The engineered T cells are then infused back into the patient's body, where they seek out and destroy cancer cells. CAR T cell therapy has shown remarkable success in treating certain types of leukemia and lymphoma, representing a significant advance in personalized medicine. Robotic surgery, enhanced precision and flexibility. 
The integration of robotics and surgery has significantly enhanced the precision, flexibility, and control beyond the limitations of human hands. Robotic surgery, utilizing systems like the Da Vinci Surgical System, allows for minimally invasive procedures with increased accuracy, reduced recovery times, and minimized risks of infection. Surgeons operate these robotic systems via consoles, which translate their hand movements into smaller, more precise movements of tiny instruments inside the patient's body. This technology exemplifies the advancement in surgical robotics, offering a new horizon in surgical techniques and patient outcomes. Regenerative Medicine – Stem Cell Therapy Regenerative medicine aims to repair or replace tissue or organ function lost due to age, disease, damage, or congenital defects. A key area within this field is stem cell therapy, which utilizes stem cells to regenerate damaged tissues. Stem cells have the unique ability to develop into different cell types, offering potential treatments for conditions such as Parkinson's disease, type 1 diabetes, and spinal cord injuries. The field of tissue engineering also falls under regenerative medicine, where biocompatible scaffolds are used to grow new tissues and organs in the lab for transplantation. Digital Health Technologies, Telemedicine and Wearables The rise of digital health technologies has significantly impacted how healthcare is delivered and experienced. Telemedicine allows patients to receive care remotely, increasing access to health care services and reducing the need for in-person visits. Wearable health devices monitor various health indicators, such as heart rate, activity levels, and sleep patterns, providing continuous data for both patients and health care providers. These advancements in health informatics and mobile health technologies signify a move towards more personalized, accessible, and data-driven health care. The rapid pace of medical breakthroughs brings hope for the treatment of previously intractable diseases, improving the quality of life for patients around the world. As these cutting-edge technologies evolve, so too does the language of medicine, incorporating new terms and concepts essential for understanding these advances. The future of healthcare looks promising, with innovations that redefine the boundaries of medicine and offer new pathways to healing. The Power of Words Mastering the Art of Persuasion and Rhetoric The art of persuasion and rhetoric stands as one of the most enduring human practices, a testament to the power of communication in shaping opinions, influencing decisions, and molding societies. At its core, Persuasion is the ability to convince others to adopt a certain viewpoint or take a specific action, while rhetoric is the art of effective or persuasive speaking or writing. Both are fundamental to various fields, from politics and law to marketing and everyday interpersonal interactions. This exploration into the art of persuasion and rhetoric will illuminate the techniques, 
argumentation strategies, and rhetorical devices that make communication not just effective but impactful. Understanding Rhetoric and Persuasion Rhetoric, as defined by Aristotle, is the faculty of observing in any given case the available means of persuasion. It encompasses three primary modes of persuasion, ethos, character, pathos, emotion, and logos, logic. Ethos appeals to the speaker's credibility or character, pathos to the audience's emotions, and logos to logical reasoning and evidence. Mastery over these modes allows a speaker or writer to construct compelling arguments that resonate with their audience. Techniques of Persuasion Reciprocity. This principle is based on the human tendency to feel obliged to return favors or concessions. In persuasive communication, offering something first, whether it's a piece of information, a positive gesture, or a concession, can increase the likelihood of receiving something in return. Scarcity, highlighting the uniqueness or limited availability of something can make it more desirable. This technique plays on the fear of missing out, FOMO, and can effectively persuade people to take action. Authority, people are more likely to be persuaded by someone who appears to be an authority on the subject. Demonstrating expertise or knowledge can enhance persuasion. Consistency. Once people commit to an idea or course of action, they are more likely to follow through with it. Persuasive tactics often involve seeking small initial commitments that can be built upon. Liking. People are more easily persuaded by individuals they like or identify with. Building rapport and finding common ground can be powerful persuasion tools. Consensus, showing that others are taking the same action or hold the same belief can persuade individuals to do the same, leveraging the social proof principle. Art of Argumentation Effective argumentation is a cornerstone of persuasion. It involves presenting a clear, coherent, and logical argument that convinces the audience of your position. Key elements include Claim a statement that asserts a viewpoint or makes an argument. Evidence, supporting information or data that backs up the claim. Reasoning, the logical process that connects the evidence to the claim. Counterargument, addressing opposing viewpoints and refuting them to strengthen your position. Rhetorical Devices Rhetorical devices are techniques that speakers and writers use to enhance their arguments and communicate more effectively. Some notable devices include Metaphor and simile Comparing two unlike things to highlight similarities enriching the narrative or argument. Alliteration and assonance. The repetition of sounds can make speech more memorable and engaging. Anaphora. The repetition of words or phrases at the beginning of successive clauses or sentences 
creating a rhythm and emphasizing a point. Rhetorical questions. Questions posed for effect rather than to solicit an answer, encouraging the audience to think more deeply about an issue. Hyperbole. Exaggerated statements or claims not meant to be taken literally, used for emphasis or effect. Conclusion The art of persuasion and rhetoric is both a science and an art, requiring understanding of human psychology 